Job chapter 32. So these three men ceased answering Job because he was righteous in his own eyes. Then the wrath of Elihu, the son of Barakul, the Buzite, of the family of Ram, was aroused against Job. His wrath was aroused because he justified himself rather than God. Also against his three friends, his wrath was aroused because they had found no answer and yet had condemned Job. Now, because they were the years older than he, Elihu waited to speak to Job. When Elihu saw that there was no answer in the mouth of these three men, his wrath was aroused. So Elihu, the son of Barakul, the Buzite, answered and said, I am young in years and you are very old. Therefore, I was afraid and dared not declare my opinion to you. I said, age should speak and the multitude of years should teach wisdom. But there is a spirit in man and the breath of the Almighty gives him understanding. Great men are not always wise, nor do the aged always understand justice. Therefore, I say, listen to me. I also will declare my opinion. Indeed, I waited for your words. I listened to your reasonings while you searched out what to say. I paid close attention to you, and surely not one of you convinced Job or answered his words, lest you should say, we have found wisdom. God will vanquish him, not man. Now, he has not directed his words against me, so I will not answer him with your words. They are dismayed and answer no more. Words escape them, and I have waited because they did not speak, because they stood still and answered no more. I also will answer my part. I too will declare my opinion, for I am full of words. The spirit within me compels me. Indeed, my belly is like a wine that has no vent. It is ready to burst like new wineskins. I will speak that I may find relief. I must open my lips and answer. Let me not, I pray, show partiality to anyone, nor let me flatter any man, for I do not know how to flatter, else my maker would soon take me away.